Prior to WWDC 2024, Apple announced few of their upcoming accessibility features for iOS 18 and one of which was eye tracking. But during the announcement of iOS 18, Apple did not talk about any of their upcoming new accessibility features for iOS 18. So we thought if they are not talking about it, we need to and in this video, let's explore and set up eye tracking feature in iOS 18. Eye tracking is a feature which allows your iPhone to track where you are looking, giving you the ability to control and navigate your iPhone even without touching it. Eye tracking can be a really great accessibility tool for all those people who have difficulty using a touch screen or for those people who just want to use their phone hands free. So now let's set it up and see how it runs on your iPhone. Open the settings app of your iPhone, tap on accessibility, scroll down and select eye tracking and toggle the switch on next to eye tracking. Follow the on-screen instruction to calibrate your eye tracking and now you will be able to control and navigate your iPhone with just your eyes. So once you have calibrated your eye tracking, now you can set the smoothness for the pointer. If you want the cursor to snap to the nearby item, you can keep this setting on or if you want, you can just turn it off. You can also auto hide the cursor if you want. And lastly, dwell controls allow you to input the action just by gazing at an area for a specific time. So dwell controls default action is tab, but you can also customize dwell control. You ask me how? Well, you need to go back to the accessibility page. Now go into touch, assistive touch, scroll down and right over there, you will have options for dwell control. You can change the fallback action. You can also set the movement tolerance according to your preference. And you can also set the hot corners. And lastly, you can also set the time for 12 action. You can also use eye tracking in conjunction to assistive touch. This can be really helpful for all the tasks which require multiple touches, for example, opening control center. Eye tracking is a powerful and a new feature of iOS 18 which makes iPhone very accessible and easy to use. If you still have further questions left regarding eye tracking, do let me know in the comment section and while you are down there, make sure to subscribe to iGeek's blog and press the bell icon so that you get notified on each and every video we post. And of course, if you find this content useful and all you need to do is just Press the like button and of course go to App Store and download iGeeks blog app and enjoy everything Apple content and amazing wallpapers as well. On this note, this is me Samir signing off and I will see you in the next one. Till then, Dada, see you. Bye.